welcome back to the Eurovision podcast. We're here at London Eurovision party and we are with the iconic Sarah Bonici. How are you? Hello, I'm fine, thank you. And you? I'm really good now that you're here. Look, you're fresh off none other than heaven last night. Ooh, yeah, it was. It was amazing. How was that? Crazy. I mean, I loved performing at Heaven. I loved meeting all the drag queens. I mean, it was it was insane. I, I loved performing. And the people there, they were, like, amazing. And you brought your dancers, right? Yeah, I did. <laughs> you gave the full show. Always. <laughs> Always. And look, when it comes to Malmo, you're going to bring your dancers, right? What do you think? <laughs> <laughs> I love it. And do you think you'll bring more? Are you going to keep the flip? You have to wait and see. Oh. I cannot read. <laughs> yeah. And how do you feel about tonight? Look, you've done, uh, you did last week, you did last night. So do you get nervous now? Are you like, no nerves, it's fine? Or will you have to do a few rituals? But I always get those butterflies before I go perform. But I think that's actually normal and healthy, I must say. Um, but yeah, I'm just enjoying performing. It's my passion. So yeah, enjoying it so much. Amazing. And look, there's kind of an interesting fact. I was doing my research on some of the other acts and seeing are there any similarities between who we've got here today. And I'm correct, right? You did um, Eurovision Junior? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I was a backup singer and dancer to the Maltese entry in 2010. 2010? Yeah, in Belarus, which was insane. So there is one other act in Eurovision this year who did do a national final for the same year in 2010. Do you know who that is? No, actually. Can you give a guess? I honestly have no idea. Sylvester. Really? He participated wow. in his national final in 2010. That's, that's crazy, I don't know. I also participated in 2009. And yes, you did. The national final, yeah, yeah, yeah. Do you think that will help you for this year? Well, obviously, it's, uh, I was way younger and it was a totally different experience, but I believe that, you know, we learn from each and every experience. So, yeah, it obviously does. Yeah. Amazing. Look, thank you so much. I don't want to keep any more of your time. This is our last question. If you could take one from the magical pot. <laughs> Have you ever tried Guinness? No, guys, I don't like beer. Sorry, Ireland. <laughs> Look, best of luck tonight. Thank you so much for talking to us. I can't wait for your performance. Same here. <laughs> Thank you.